fellow beginning theater students, welcome to our monologue unit videos. Acting is a strange thing to do, because all you really are doing is being. And shouldn't being be easy? Well, no. It can be the hardest thing to do. Well, for me at least. Maybe you'd get a different answer from Meryl Streep or maybe Robert De Niro. There are many different ways you can learn to create believable characters, but the most famous, famous way might be the method. You might have heard of the method before. Many famous Hollywood actors use the method to help create their characters, like Leonardo DiCaprio or Jim Carrey. But many of these famous actors have taken the method to an extreme form, trying to live the same lives as their characters live. For example, if their character was a heavy smoker or drinker, these actors would become heavy smokers or drinkers to try and achieve a more desirable performance. This is not what we are doing. At its base form, the method is just answering a series of questions about who you think your character is. You answer the questions based on any information you get from the play itself, and if the answer isn't there, it's what you think the answer is. The questions are, who am I? What time is it? Where am I? What surrounds me? What are the given circumstances? What are my relationships? What is my objective? And what is the action? That's a lot of questions, but don't worry. All of them will be written down for you. This is just to help you get an idea of what you will be thinking about. The method was created by Konstantin Stanislavsky, a Russian act actor and theater practitioner. In the method, you use these questions to help you find what your actor wants. It's up to you how you think your character would act to get what they want. The following is a quote from his book, An Actor Prepares. Never lose yourself on stage. Always act in your own person as an artist. You can never get away from yourself. The moment you lose yourself on the stage marks the departure from truly living your part and the beginning of exaggerated false acting. Always and forever, when you are on stage, you must play yourself. But it will be an infinite variety of combinations, of objectives, and given circumstances which you have prepared for your part and which have been smelted in the furnace of emotion memory. What you want is your objective. How you get that is called your tactic. Now, if you want to know more about Stanislavski and, and the method, I've included more information about him and it in a link below. Watch the ne next video to find out how to fill out your worksheet and the activities that we'll be doing with it.